Hi, I'm Steve Footit, a member of the Seed Biology Group, led by Professor Bill Finch-Savage. How to respond and adapt to global warming is a major challenge for UK agriculture. Here in the Seed Biology Group, we're interested in how global warming will impact on weed and crop seed behaviour. And in particular, we're interested in how global warming will impact seed dormancy. In this field here behind me, there are literally millions of weed seeds all waiting to germinate and emerge. The dormancy of these seeds is continually changing in tune with changes the seasonal change in soil temperature. And over hundreds if not thousands of generations, seeds of different species have adapted their dormancy cycle so that they will germinate and emerge at different times of the year in order to take advantage of gaps in the vegetation and this makes them highly effective competitors with our crops. Now some of these species have adapted so that their seeds will lose dormancy and germinate following soil disturbance in the autumn. They will then overwinter as the vegetative plant, flower in the spring and these are called winter annuals and we see some examples here. Others have adopted an alternative strategy whereby they remain in the soil dormant over winter, germinate and emerge in the spring and flower in the summer and these are called summer annuals and we see some here which are flowering at the present time. So how do we investigate the impact of global warming as it will be experienced in Britain in the coming years? So let's go and see how we do that. To understand how seed dormancy and seedling emergence will respond to global warming, we've been using Warwick Crop Centre's unique thermal gradient tunnels to simulate the four degree increase in temperature predicted in the UK between now and 2080. Using a series of temperature sensors, heaters and fans, we were able to set up a temperature gradient running from ambient to 4 degrees centigrade above ambient 24 hours a day for two years. Using the model species Arabidopsis thaliana, more commonly known as Thalecress, we looked at the impact of global warming on plant growth, seed dormancy and seedling emergence. In this species plant size was found to increase with temperature and in the future this will give us bigger weeds which will use more water and soil nitrate which are valuable resources for crops. In seeds produced under these temperatures seed dormancy was found to decrease as the temperature experienced during seed production increased. So as global warming advances in the UK we have the potential for weed seeds to have a lower dormancy and to emerge more frequently as the soil is ploughed and tilled. This will increase competition with crop plants for resources such as water, nitrate and light. Whether all, all weeds will respond in this way is at the moment uncertain and it is by continuing this research that we hope to answer these questions in the future. Thank you.